Golf Digest called him the golfer in chief, but because he used to slam President Obama. He played more golf last year than Tiger Woods. Trump is getting heat because he himself has been doing so much golfing. He's the Tiger Woods of hypocrisy. Before he was president, Trump posted tweets like, can you believe that with all of the problems and difficulties facing the U.S., President Obama spent the day playing golf? Because I'm going to be working for you. I'm not going to have time to go play golf. Believe me, fuck. Hard to believe President Trump seems to have played golf at least 10 times in his first two months. We say seems because the White House avoids talking about it. As a CBS reporter tweeted, White House press aide wouldn't say if POTUS played golf. Told of Twitter photo of POTUS in golf attire, she said he may have hit a few balls. Reporters have resorted to poring over photographs like this, looking for telltale signs. Aha, he's wearing a golf glove. Trump has said it's best for a president to play with other leaders. I would not have made certain deals if it weren't for golf. Big deals. The only time we saw him play golf with a leader, the president gave Japan's prime minister a pat on the shoulder. Golf diplomacy? Help for foster deeper relationships in Southeast Asia, uh, in Asia rather. So who is the better golfer, Obama or Trump? Golf Digest calls Trump the best golfer to ever hold the presidency with a 2.8 handicap compared to Obama's 13. And look who else golfs. There's Ivanka in a dress billowing like Marilyn Monroe's and high heels instead of golf shoes. But with the president sneaking off, we're going to need a little birdie to tell us when he's gone golfing. President Trump for the birdie. Genimo, CNN. Look at that. Oh. New York.